Hi, Fun Chasers. It's a beautiful day, but there's trouble on the horizon. I've got my awning up, but those storm clouds look like they could be trouble. This happened to me once before, and it ruined my awning. So I'm not going to take any chances. Even though I'm by myself, I'm going to take this awning down. I have a carefree awning. Your awning might come down a little bit differently, but I think most people realize they have to start with lowering the arms first. Make sure your doors are closed. And just take down it a little bit from this side. Let that snap in place. Watch the other side. Don't go down too far. Snap in place. Main thing is don't panic. Just keep bringing it down a little bit at a time. This next time. Now, if you're unsure about doing the rest of the awning, you can just drop it down this low and you're probably in pretty good shape. But I'm gonna put the rest of the way away. Remember to undo your arms and take your deflappers back. That's liable to mess you up. You always wanna do it in reverse order from the way you put it up. Okay. Don't forget, these are clipped in at the top. You don't want to force it down. It goes all the way down. You hit that rivet. Okay. This is when it's helpful to have more hands. So things don't get away from me. I use a bungee strap. I'm just going to let that rest here as I undo the lock. And with mine, that's the lock. Okay. There we go up. All the way up. We're safe. You can lock them in if you're, if you're ready to travel or you're good. You know, if you're just trying to get out of the rain and not have a problem, you're good. No worries. You've successfully closed your awning. Well, done that, just figure. You were panicking, the wind was rising, and the storm went the other way. Well, you can still put your awning out and you can do it by yourself, just like you put it away. You just do it all in reverse order. Open up your locks all the way on both sides. Now there's two releases on this. One's clear at the top. On the newer models, it is a little bit easier. That's right at the arm. So let's pull it out. Extend it fully. Bring the arms up. Make sure that snaps into place. Tighten down your arms. Sometimes I've done this and I've got it all the way up. And I have to bring it back down to tighten my arms and put my deflappers on. Did it on this side, we could do it on the other side. Sliding the arm up. Checking it to make sure it's locked in place. Tightening the arms. The flappers engaged. 
and we're ready to start putting our awning. And just do that in little short bursts. Let's do a couple holes at a time. It's not a race. We'll get all worked up about it. Almost there. Keep track as you do this because in case you do get a little rain, you want to make sure your awning is tilted slightly. Now one thing I learned is that Carefree calls this a sunshade. Not a rainfall. It's a sunshade. Get on the fourth hole. And go just a little bit higher here. Okay. And that's really it. You've done it. You didn't break your awning. Your wife will be so impressed. Thanks for watching. Please remember to subscribe, like, and share. And for even more fun tales, please go to our website at www.thefunchasers.com.